Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News in High Definition. Glaucoma blinds about 100,000 Americans every year. It slowly destroys vision because it can be so difficult to control. Now there's a new procedure that may take care of the problem for good, and health specialist Denise Dador shows us how it's done. This is great for a lot of people. The effects of glaucoma are slow and insidious. Most people don't even notice anything is wrong until it's too late. Managing glaucoma involves a series of eye drops and then surgery once the problem reaches its end stages. Now there's a new procedure designed to prevent prevent glaucoma from progressing. So this is your second time, are you all ready? First is right eye, now is left. 80-year-old Harry now hopes this final procedure will stop his glaucoma from getting worse. His doctor warned him to take action. They said, oh, your pressure is too high, you know, because you could go blind if it keeps going up. In glaucoma, the eye's drainage system doesn't work. Fluid buildup puts pressure on the optic nerve and eventually destroys vision. The first line of treatment, eye drops to control fluid retention. But the drops made Harry's eyes very dry. Next, he tried a laser treatment, but the benefits didn't last. The last resort, surgery. The traditional glaucoma surgery called trabeculectomy has quite a few risks associated with it. In the most common surgical procedure for glaucoma, doctors penetrate the eye and create a hole to reduce the pressure. In canaloplasty, it's completely different. Doctors say, think of it as angioplasty for the eye. With canaloplasty, we do not penetrate the eye. Instead, Dr. Richardson cuts a tiny flap at the top of the eye. This animation provided by the makers of the medical device shows how surgeons find an opening in the eye's natural drainage system, insert a microcatheter to expand the canal, and then keep it open with a stent. This surgery is really the first surgery that allows us to give patients with glaucoma a surgical treatment before they get to that end stage of glaucoma. That's why Harry chose canaloplasty. The biggest risk, Dr. Richardson says, is occasionally it's not effective. But if Harry's left eye works as well as his right, he won't have to worry about glaucoma treatments for the rest of his life. I might be 80 years old, but I might, be, I might live to be 100. I don't know. You will. Canaloplasty is recommended for patients with open angle glaucoma, the most common form. If you've already had glaucoma surgery, then you're not a candidate. Only about a dozen local doctors perform canaloplasty. Dr. Richardson says more and more insurance companies are starting to cover it. ADHD.